Thursday, 16th of August. Just packed away nice and early. Gonna have a quick bit of breakfast now. And then it's up up the mountain now. So that should be a good day. See if we can climb as high as we can before it gets hot. But now it's a nice, perfect cool temperature. Okay, today there are a new funny thing is I have water bottle there. I have water bottle there and I have water bottle there and water bottle there. So I have one, two, three, four bottles on my bike. Mm -hmm. That yeah. is very crazy. Yes. Now we're packed away. <laughs> Just as the sun is coming up over there. That's perfect. Just get our bikes up that gravel track there and then we're back on the road. So let's go. Let's go. Probably the last place we can buy water for the next uh, few hundred kilometers. Let's see how it goes. Okay, so now we're heading into the mountains. Today's just today climbing. The road should turn to gravel in a short while. And then it's just up and up and up. Going towards a town called Kazaman. Uh, there's no shops after this town here, so uh, carrying as much water and food as we can. And then we'll see how it goes. Maybe we can find water from a natural spring or stream or something we'll see how it goes but uh, yeah i'm carrying as much as we can it makes it heavy bikes are heavy now but uh, yeah not much we can do about that so uh, we'll see how it goes see we can climb the mountains now hello hello that's a nice small village here i think this is the village where the two boys on the horse came from yesterday they're also very nice and friendly people so yeah, looks like the road is already starting to turn into a track. Well, that was the end of the tarmac. Let's see how bumpy it's going to be. Is it going to be as bumpy as the F26 in Iceland? Let's see. Salam, salam, salam. <laughs> I've well, just had a rest here and lunch. Some small houses here. Some children that are living here as well. So. Let's uh, see if we can get a bit further down the road. And 15 kilometers today, so completely different speed we're doing today. Mm -hmm. Bye. Mm -hmm. Only seen children here. We haven't seen any adults. This is our first camp spot on the mountain here. Nice quiet place. There's a few other people living in some kind of uh, houses over there or shelters or whatever we call them. And, uh, so 
Some pretty big mountains around us now. Some other people living over there. Some kind of trailer they're living in, I think. So, not on own here. It's a very beautiful spot here. And tomorrow we're carrying up the mountain. So, uh, I think we're 1,800 metres now. I have to carry on, see how far we get. We've done 30 kilometres today on very bumpy, stony roads. Pretty hard going. <laughs> so, completely different kind of riding, but we're moving. 82 kilometers now to a town called Kazaman and uh, when we get there there should be some kind of homestay we can stay in but uh, until we get there we're camping so we'll do see if we can do 30 more tomorrow and we're well on the way so that was the end of today we came uh, 30 kilometers up towards the, the pass uh, really hard on the very stony road well that's what I thought anyway but also felt a bit weak after being sick still, so uh, the bigger problem is that um, I'm starting to feel a bit homesick. Um, the trip has been great so far and we have experienced so much and I'm so glad we went and we have had a great time. But now I just feel like I'm full up and I have experienced enough and met enough people and nothing seems exciting anymore because I think I've seen it all. Well, that's how I feel. Andrew doesn't feel like that at all. He's always excited about new things. Um, Jamie is a bit homesick sometimes, but easy to get motivated again. So really, really difficult <laughs> when one out of three want to go home and one is in the middle and one definitely don't want to go home. So hard. So now I'm considering trying to motivate myself to bike through Kyrgyzstan and then uh, We'll fly to India as planned and hire a car there and drive around and then um, maybe that will be the end of the trip for me and Jamie, we will go home after there. Um, but if that's the way it is, then I'll also be really satisfied with myself and we have had a great time and experienced so much and I'm just full of with experiences. So, yeah, it's not so easy and it's really, really annoying when and we don't want the same thing, so yeah, we'll see what happens. But uh, good night today here from the mountain. Mm -hmm.